Hello and welcome back to the channel. Today, due to the recent death of Dustin Diamond, I thought it might be kind of fun to take a look back at the series that he gave a big part of his life to from 1987 until the year 2000. Now, I'm not going to sit here and do a, a review of the character Screech or the show Good Morning Miss Bliss or Saved by the Bell or Saved by the Bell The College Years or Saved by the Bell The New Class or the Saved by the Bell wedding special, or even the damn Saved by the Bell reboot from 2020. Now, today we're looking at... Zach Morris is Trash! Zach Morris is Trash is a Funny or Die series that ran from 2017 to 2019 in which a narrator summarizes the various antics of Saved by the Bell protagonist Zach Morris and how they make him one of the most ruthlessly unlikable characters in sitcom history. Each episode only runs for a few minutes, which is nice because the longer you watch them, the more you just want to punch Zach Morris right in the damn face. This show makes Zach look like such a piece of shit. Look, some examples of the antics are the time Zach Morris dated Slater's kid sister and the time Zach Morris was a domestic abuser. Or hey, how about that one time Zach Morris put a baby in a gym bag and lost it? And how can we forget about the time Zach Morris framed Slater for a hate crime? Yeah, these are all topics that get covered in the show, and the list just goes on. They're hysterical. And quickly going back to Screech, like one last time here, his character is... It gets he gets screwed over so many times by by Zach, and that's a big part of what you learn in these Zach Morris' trash episodes. So Dustin Diamond's character Screech was was really sort of a clueless dork that you either wanted to hate or punch him for being an idiot half the time. Think about this, 1987 to 2000, that's a long time to be playing the same damn idiot. But let's move on. I'll say that I did grow up watching Saved by the Bell when it was first premiered on NBC in 1989. I missed the junior high episodes under the title Good Morning Miss Bliss because my parents, they didn't, they didn't have cable. And, you know, they didn't have the Disney Channel. So I had no idea that that junior high season even existed. However, I would say I was about eight or nine when the first season came out on NBC, so I'm not entirely sure if I was even the target audience for it, but I did watch it, and I found the show funny, upbeat, and I liked uh, I liked the fast talking of Zach Morris, like trying to explain his plans and stuff. However, when you look at the episodes of Zach Morris's Trash, it paints the character in a completely different light, and it's fucking hysterical. Go watch, uh, going back and watching Saved by the Bell as an adult is difficult, due to no longer seeing what's going on from the perspective of a child's mind. Now, Zach Morris's trash makes this translation pretty easy. So the things they wrote this character doing were terrible, and I couldn't stop chuckling and laughing uh, at just how fucking terrible Zach Morris really is. I mean, this guy was a misogynistic, narcissistic douche who completely cared for nobody other than himself. Now, granted, Zach Morris is a fictional character, but there are people out there who really do this kind of shit. So you know how the saying goes, does life imitate art, or does art imitate life? If you've never watched the series, it is a fantastic way to spend a few minutes while you're folding laundry or doing some other randomly dreadful energy draining task that we all have to do on a daily basis. I definitely recommend this one as it's brilliant. And if you want to watch the series, you can find it streaming on funnyordie.com or on Amazon Prime. Be sure to give us a like or subscribe if you enjoyed today's video. Hit the bell for notifications. Also, if you want to watch more videos, be sure to go through our playlist. And if you're interested in the music of TCRXP, our latest EP called All Good Things Part 1 is now streaming on Spotify and all over the internet. And it's also available here on YouTube. Until next time.